In this video, we'll see how to implement Chrome's custom tabs and display web content in your application. Displaying web content on your application can also be done using web view and customizing it. But this takes a lot of effort and more importantly, provides a bad user experience. Chrome was built to display web content and with custom tabs, you can now customize it to fit your app's theme and give the best user experience. I've made a simple demo application to demonstrate the use of custom tabs. I have one button in the activity and on clicking it, the custom tab opens up with the URL passed to it. Let's look at the Java part of it. I've declared and initialized the button here. I've declared a string here to which I'm assigning the URL that the custom tab will be displaying the content of. In the on click listener of the button, I'm calling the function open custom tab, which I've declared outside the on create. It takes one parameter, which is the URL. Before writing the code of opening the custom tab, we need to import the custom tabs library in the app level gradle file. To create a custom tab, we'll first create a builder object using the Chrome tabs intent dot builder class. You can provide customizations to the tab using this builder object. For example, you can set the toolbar color of the tab to fit your color's theme by writing builder dot set toolbar color and providing a color inside it. If you want to add a share option to the tab, which will help the user share the link, you can do that by using builder dot add default share menu item. You can customize the tab further to fit your needs. I provide a link in the description which tells you what exactly is possible. After you've written the code for customization, you can now build the builder object and assign it to an object of the custom tabs intent class. Use this object to call the launch URL function which will open the tab. This function takes in two parameters. The first is the context of the activity and the next is the parsed URL. You can parse the URL by using the URI.parse and pass the URL inside it. That's about it. Let's run the application and see how it looks. When I click the button, the tab opens up and as you can see, the tab's color matches with that of my application. It also has a share button. The source code of this application can be found by clicking the repository link in the description below. Do like and subscribe for more on-point videos just like this one.